Well, if you're a fan of comedy and theater, you're going to love this one. Love Boat and Good Times TV icons Ted Lang and Brandon Sanis are coming to the Pompano Beach Cultural Center for a humorous and insightful stage play called Willie and Esther. And the television legends are joining us this morning on Inside South Florida. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? <laughs> I am great. My mom and dad and everyone in my family would be so tickled that I'm talking to two of the icons we grew up loving on the small screen. Great to have you both here. Let's talk about this Thank play, you. Willie and Esther. Yes, Ted, I want to start with you. How did this idea come about and how, this, how did this partnership with Bernadette materialize on stage? Well, you know, Bernadette and I have known each other since we were kids. When uh, I was running around Hollywood and she was a big star on Good Times and I used to go over there and watch them film and I was very friendly with the creator, Eric Monty. So we've known each other since uh, Good Times was first on the air and I was doing a show called That's My Mama. Now, Bernadette, uh, we, she arranged, uh, her and her husband, Kevin, arranged to do this play, and they thought, and they thought, they said, who would be a good person? And thank goodness, Bernadette thought of me. So I, uh, she called me up, and uh, we agreed, that I agreed to join her in this adventure. Well, it's so cool to see. Bernadette, tell us about the play, Willie and Esther. What are audiences going to experience? What what makes this play such a wonderful uh, piece of theater? Theater. Theater. Because these people, um, they're like more or less black collar people. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, you know, they're, 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 she's a beautician and he is a producer. So anyway, they're, they're on the street. They're very common, everyday people, except they're not very educated, but they're very wise. You know what I'm saying? But it's really funny, the things that they do, the things that they say, the way they are. You know, they're not like Ted and I really are, but I mean, we really <laughs> bring it. It's like, <laughs> oh my God, really? Okay. Ted, you are also so creative behind the scenes, behind the lens. You are a very successful playwright and you're going to be hosting a special workshop for aspiring writers to also ascend to great heights in theater. I, I'm sorry, I, can't, I have to say that. I've been dying all week to I talk like to you about it. I like you say that. Thank you, yeah. thank you. you know, yeah. it's, it's specifically this for you. But no, Ted, speak to uh, this workshop that you're going to be having and uh, why is it such a wonderful thing? Well, I've been uh, uh, writing since the 70s and I picked up a few things and I think it's always good to pay it forward and pass it on. So uh, sometimes when I go around the country doing different things, I always include a, a day or an afternoon when I can um, pass on the information that I learned as a writer and uh, teach young aspiring writers some of the things I learned about uh, navigating and putting together a good story that can be told. So I've written 25 plays, uh, about a half dozen of them are on YouTube. If you ever want to see them, you just go to YouTube, type in my name. But there's fun and I, I started out as an actor and I didn't know I could write till I saw some of the television writers I was working with. I said, hey, hey, man, I can do this. And so sure. that's what happened. And Bernadette, you yourself also have tremendous talents outside of acting. You are a prolific writer. Wow. I was reading one of your books about finance, finance 101. Where, where does that love of writing come from? And are we getting more books in the future? Well, you know, I, I wanted to write a series of books called 101, you know, basic stuff. So I wrote Situations 101, Relationships first. Yes. about you know relationships basic stuff that happens in relationships that maybe you know you can take some some hints from and um i realized that i had i had a couple of daughters in, in college my two daughters and they you know they forget that you know when you use a credit card you got to pay it back uh -huh. and I'm like, right Wait a minute. you know and they didn't even understand that and i'm like well, how did you not understand that so you know when young people go to college they give them credit cards and they don't understand how finances work so I said, you know what I'm going to do? If my daughters don't really get it, a lot of people probably don't get it. And so I wrote something very basic. And it also helps adults in certain things, things that we already know that we need to be reminded of. So it's really nice right. and basic and it helps. Thank you for spending your time on Inside South Florida. 
Come for oh, a good laugh. Oh, and thank you for having us. And you're an awesome, awesome interviewer.